Hello beautiful queens and welcome to Here is My Canvas. My name is Ndombien Gosikumete and I am so happy that you guys are back. You're here, you're subscribed and you are amazing and absolutely beautiful. I'm so glad you decided to come back and watch yet another video. Mm, like I said, we are still in Madagascar, like I said in my last video. We are still in the wonderful, wonderful country of Madagascar. Um, last time, the hairstyle that I showed you guys uh, was more of a hairstyle you can go out with and stay with for at least maybe two weeks. I stayed with it for like two weeks, yes. So two to three weeks, it's a protective hairstyle. But it's summer here in South Africa. And I thought, I want a fun hairstyle. I want a hairstyle that I can go out and just be like, Summer, Gila, I am here, Summer. So um, I decided to do the Bantu knots because they're so refreshing. So not hot and not stressful and easy to do as well. So um, the wonderful ladies of Madagascar um, do this hairstyle as well. Um, but I've already explained what they do with their uh, particular hairstyle. I am Zulu and from South Africa and we also do this hairstyle. Actually, the word Bantu knots comes from um, South Africa. It comes from um, the Zulu people, from the word Abantu, which means people. And that's what they used to call um, the Zulu or black people um, in South Africa. They used to call them Bantu. So this particular hairstyle comes, that word comes from this particular hairstyle that they used to do quite a lot. So enough of the history lesson. All right, so back to how I did this particular hairstyle. I basically used some, what do they call it? I never know what to call this thing, extensions. We call them extensions here in Durban. So I'm gonna use that word, extensions. And then we, you're gonna do a two strand twist with these extensions and then you're going to tie it off with the hair tie at the very beginning um it's easier for you to just do that the two strand twist once you've tied it up but it's also going to help you now so once that is done then you're going to take your ankara fabric and then you are going to cut it into a long strip that can cover this so now you're going to take the hair tie and the Ankara fabric, take the Ankara fabric, puts it into the hair tie, just twirl it around the, the two strand twist and just bring it up so that it covers this yucky part um, of the twist. Uh, you're going to need to cover it anyway. So yeah, you cover it up and then you basically just wrap you wrap the fabric around the two strand twist there's no need to be particular in any way we're just wrapping no need to be perfect usually i'm a perfectionist but ha! not this time devil is a liar not this time okay geba fere we're just going to wrap and wrap and wrap and just keep wrapping until you get to the very end of this. Once you get to the very end, then you're going to use, um, I'm using a little small anyana elastic that I'm just going to wrap around. You can use anything you really also use yarn. It's just to secure. And make sure it doesn't unravel and then that's it that is your beautiful Ankara little twist okay so now you're going to take the hair tie I've already sectioned my hair out I don't know if I said it into eight sections so four in the front two over here at the top and then two at the back please don't mind my outfit <laughs> um and then two at the back and then um once you've sectioned them out you do a th three strand twist and then now i'm going to take the hair tie part and i'm going to just put it into the three strand twist that's all you're doing once is enough 
and then let me just show you what I'm doing just going to make sure that this is all wrapped around and you don't see it just twist and twist and twist take the hair as well and then twist around twist around and hold okay then now you're going to take um the twist that we have right here and like i said last time with um bantu knots basically just twisting you twist and you twist gonna have to pull so that it gets into the sausage roll looking thing that it is so you just twist sometimes the fabric unravels on you it's okay just tuck and twist tuck and twist my darlings okay that is not covered properly so let me just push it in make sure that it's covered properly you don't want to see yeah yeah okay then i'm twisting some more twisting and pulling that's all we're doing here good people just twisting and pulling until you get to the very end of this beautiful beautiful creation <laughs> twisting and pulling twisting and pulling okay there's no need to secure this one because i promise you it's not going anyway if you twist it and pulled correctly and uh, it's not going anywhere so as you can see it's trying to peek through no 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 I'm going to cover you no pickables here no pickables okay yay so i think it looks pretty let me just look at myself in the mirror because i mean the phone can lie but yeah i am happy with how that came out and then um here in the front i basically just crocheted it into um these two strand twist tiny little ones crochet them into um these two bantu knots at the bottom here and then i added some fun i'm sorry for not looking at you guys i'm busy looking at myself now i forget that i'm talking to you so <laughs> i apologize greens so um i just added some decorative stuff um and my special <laughs> My special mannequins. It's so cute. I found it at the store. I was like, I'm going to use this one day. And today is the day. <laughs> shine, my lovely. Shine. So, yeah. You can decorate it any way you want. Again, I told you I love spice. And this is my spice. So, yeah. I think I look fabulous okay so this is the front and then let's make goba so you guys can see okay let me turn this way so you guys can see the back i hope you can see that my lines are not very straight but i don't think this is one of those hairstyles wait things need to be perfect as long as you feel amazing you look good and hey, well in life you must tell yourself you know you must tell yourself wake up in the morning i'm like yes nah nah you way nah mostly <laughs> gorgeous so anyway i think it came out really nice and yeah please try it out and let me know 
how it turned out what were your issues with it and but i don't think you should have any issues with this it's so easy and it's so cute and it didn't take forever so thank you so much for joining me i will see you in the next upcoming video i think i'm having so much fun with ankara fabric that i might just do another tutorial um, using ankara fabric so thank you so much you guys for watching do enjoy the rest of your day if it's during the day or the rest of your night if it's during the night thank you for watching i'll see you in the next video Mwah.